could learn more tonight about the city's plans moving forward regarding the Centerpoint project in downtown Lexington that started back in 2008. This renewed controversy comes after the city and developer have exchanged letters this week. WKYT's Hillary Thornton tells us where the project stands now. Hillary. While there has been plenty of growth and developments here in the downtown area since 2008, when the Centerpoint project initially started, all there is to show for those seven years at the project site is now a giant hole, and tensions are growing between the developer and the city as their war of words continues. The two parties have exchanged letters stating differing demands and visions for what has now been dubbed Center Pit. The most recent play coming from the developer, Dudley Webb, whose project manager fired off a letter of his own yesterday in response to the city's letter demanding the site be restored to its original state. The developer's letter outlines work being done at the site even as recent as this week. Now, this letter came a day after the city sent what they call a notice of written demand, referencing an agreement signed back in December of 2013. That agreement states that once ground is broken, work must not be stopped for 60 consecutive days. The agreement goes on to say if this does happen, the developer must restore the area to its original state, including dirt, utilities, fencing, and grass. Webb says the city's letter has had an immediate negative impact, causing one tenant to withdraw from the project. With Webb responding, the ball is back in the city's hands. Leaders say their next move is discussing this latest chapter in the Centerpoint controversy at tonight's council meeting. In Lexington, Hillary Thornton, WKYT. Hillary, thank you. And the city's attorney says the agreement was written in a way that allows the city to fill the hole for Webb. But if they beat him to it and fill the hole first, then Webb would have to pay the city $4.4 million to finance it.